Hello everybody. I know it's been another minute since I've been on here. It's just with everything going on with YouTube and it's kind of scary and uh, I keep researching and, and doing those things. But today I have a haul for all y'all. So I mentioned in my last planner video that I had placed an order on I think it was Cyber Monday at Michael's so I have that for you. I have a few things I found at the Target dollar spot. So let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, so let's start with Target. So I grabbed these sticker books. They were uh, $3 a piece. This one is the sticker book for wellness and the inspirational sticker book. So the colors are very pastel with a little bit of royal blue, but they group the pages together. So when you get duplicates, they're all together. And then I also got this planner, which was $3. I needed something lighter that I could carry around with me and kind of brain dump in. So it's literally just a, pl uh, a planner that looks like this and it's undated uh, so you have a notes page and then a week and then a notes page and then a week and it just keeps going and um, they had a bunch of different ones the paper is so nice and thick I can't even explain to you how great it is I have started using it and honestly, I think this is going to be where like all my scribble scrabble and some stickers go and then I'll have my main like pretty planner. <laughs> so, um, like I said, I just carry this around and chicken scratch in it and then it does have a pocket on the back cover and these are the stickers that were from my recollections planner from 2019. So I'm using those up and I will use it. I will use stickers in here that I just need to use up or like aren't full kits or that I can't make work in another kit just functionally to kind of just make certain things pop out like you're seeing here. So that is that planner, which is really thin and honestly it works out great. It's just, it looks like a notebook. It doesn't look like a big thick planner. Then, in the inspirational book here, let's see if I can fold this plastic back. Um, they're stickers, so we just have a very random assortment of stickers. This is like a kind of thumbs up, thumbs down day with some circle icons, and you have four of those pages. And this page has some more functional things. And they're all matte stickers. So there's four pages of that one. And this one is all in blues and it's just various motivational quotes. There's one page of that one. We have some flags, things to do, don't forget, a weekly goal, a monthly goal, and then some little don't forget flags. And we have three of those. And we have some very large habit trackers, um, some checklists, get it done, and then circles or dots, and then more like checklists. And there's four or is there five of those? No, there's four of those. Then we have another quote page, a different quote page, some large flag boxes. There's one, two, three, four of those. And then this page is just purely functional. four of those, another quote page, and then we have like a relaxed date night, girls weekend coffee cups, um, and then just repeats, and I think 
that. There are four of those as well. There's three or four of them. There's four of five of those. So they really anticipated you using that page a lot. Another quote page, and that sums up the inspirational sticker book. <clears throat> and then we have the sticker book for wellness. Again, it was $3. And this one, it's kind of a mixed bag. So you have your exercise stuff, but there's also things like payday, pay bills, appointment, like little arrows. And then you have strength, cardio, and yoga. And again, it's the same kind of setup with the multiple pages of the same stickers. And then we have some very large habit trackers, some step trackers, and hydrate trackers. And like four of those. And then we have some email, call, bills, large check boxes, and then some like quotes. And then now, someday, and whenever for goal setting. And then some more check boxes and um, various things. And then we have a today, later, and maybe. This page has some to do and take note, like markers workout goals and then you have like cardio rest and exercise and then your goal dots and bigger dots sorry i'm i think i'm getting sick and my voice is kind of giving out and then <laughs> this is funny you're like really organized um and then you have some other quotes up here and then these they're not dots they're not like perfect circles are kind of wonky um, these are like the days of the week and then we have next week, today, later, maybe, and then do amazing things and my stuff at the bottom. There's three of that one. And we have some do what you love. You can only fail if you quit. And then like meal plan boxes, three of those. And then we have be productive with little flowers, things to do, me day, relax, R&R, treat yourself. And then you have like some prioritize little guys down here then here is like goals brilliant ideas epic ideas my plan and as you can see it they do put a good bleed around them and then we go to this page which has a, a week up here which they are circles a little deco leaf and then work hard play hard various little things up here dots and squares and triangles and some full boxes i think that might be it yes it is so now let's move on to michael's so i showed you guys this sticker book a fair bit ago and I've seen it used quite a bit on YouTube but if you check out my other plan with me you will see it in there because I I definitely uh, just took some of the clear stickers for my monthly spread so if you're interested in seeing that one go check it out and then I got these two sticker books and my planner so let's start with the sticker books because they're kind of moot at this point so this one was Christmas joy and it's so absolutely beautiful you just have all this beautiful foiling and sentiments and deco and here's like nutcracker deco and we have tis the season with the little trucks and bicycles and then a gingerbread theme and then you have full boxes and more full boxes. Just a beautiful llama, Christmas llamas, like Santa riding a llama, like craziness. All is calm with the foil and then more llamas. And then like a Christmas bucket list and washi strips. And then you have a, the 12 days of Christmas song in full boxes. So you could actually do this as a countdown over the 12 days of Christmas. You have these beautiful foiled words, Christmas words. I don't want to really say bucket list, but like 
holiday gift budget, holiday playlist, Christmas parade, warm wishes, celebrate the season. Just absolutely stunning with that gold foil and white background. And then you have some, the same words with multicolors and white lettering. And then a beautiful washi page here, more washi here. Then you have date dots. So you have the candies with gold foils and then the wreaths with gold foil. Just stunning. Checklists. And then a like annual Christmas countdown. The problem is I don't think I'd ever remember to do this. 365 days till Christmas. So that needs to go on New Year's Day or New Year's Eve. It would be New Year's Eve. Then when you get to 300, 200, 100, 75, 50, 25, 10. And then you can, you have four to kind of mark whatever. And then you have some holiday budget sidebars dinner menu to buy shopping gift list some weekend banners some more gift lists and things some weekend like double boxes which are adorable so some full checklists with headers and then these beautiful just foil boxes which are just gorgeous this is a uh, foiled letters and numbers on clear and black on clear and then multicolored edges with white and that's everything in the Christmas Joy 979 piece sticker book from Happy Planner. <clears throat> this one I'll actually get use out of <laughs> coming up so that's at least good right? So a couple years ago I bought the first like seasonal sticker book they came out with and I absolutely adored it. I was able to pull some beautiful spreads out of there. This one is separated starting with spring. So you have checklists and full boxes and sidebars and then these full boxes that are all foiled and this book is rose gold foiled. So that'll be a nice change. And these cute little boxes and then double boxes clear florals, large, small, and then some of, I guess, April showers, and then your March, St. Patrick's Day stuff. And then you move into summer. Love this sun-kissed ombre box. It's just stunning. The multi-box page, the rounded full box page, the double box page and all this ice cream on clear the fruit and palm leaves on this really cool like goldy background and then you have flamingos then we go into fall and we have a mix of just fall Halloween and Thanksgiving really cute love this green here with the pumpkin it is so pretty so it's the same setup, they just change the theming based on, this is adorable. You guys know it's adorable. Then you have the full deco for fall. And like I was trying to say, you, you, they change, it's the same setup, they just change the theme based on the time of year. So we have more pumpkins and apples and then we get into winter and you have your very popular black and white buffalo plaid and these go these stickers here so you have your rose gold foiling on this page they kind of work well with the Christmas joy book which I'm really happy about because you have the llama the nutcracker and you have more Nutcracker. Um, I think this duplicates in both books. This one kind of does, but not exactly. Again, we have Santas and Llamas. And then you have in rose gold your holidays throughout the year. And then you have snow day, rainy day, 
winter, fall, spring, and summer. So when those start and some arrows. And that's everything in the Happy Year sticker book. And I think they did a fantastic job. Um, really good quality stickers. I love Happy Planner stickers. And then here it is, the planner for 2020. So first up it says, imagine, create, and inspire in gold foil on the front of this faux leather cover. Um, it's chipboard with this like faux pleather on top and then this beautiful watercolory star scene on the inside, which I really loved. The only thing I didn't realize when I was buying this is an 18 month planner. So I'm going to have to rip out a bunch, but that meant that I got the bigger coil. All right. So we're going to start out. This is a recollections vertical planner and it comes with a zipper bag in the front your 2019 2020 dashboard and this is make it happen with this beautiful water color by the way these are my favorite colors so you have 2019 at a glance and 2020 at a glance and then this year in review i'm not exactly i think it's just like an annual habit tracker maybe like you set one habit and check it off every day for a year or you circle like the important I don't know if you guys have any clue what this is for um definitely let me know whatever that page is and then we have important contacts and our sticker pages which these are fairly similar except we only got one row of blank labels and last year's version and this year has two and I love these colors these are my favorite colors oh my gosh and you have the functional page the kind of decorative full boxy page and then your icon page and then you have your folder in the planner so it's glossy it's high quality and very pretty, it's double-sided. So like I said, this planner was 18 months, so it started in July, and I'm gonna go ahead and skip to January, because pretty much this is all coming out, and I might pick up an A5 and just put it in there for like mock spreads maybe, I don't know. So, um, this is not something <laughs> that I got from Michaels, I just put it in there as marker. Uh, same thing, this is an old Erin Condren roller that I use as a bookmark and for various things when I'm planning. So very beautiful purple for January. Here's the monthly and the weekly view. So it's set up a lot like everybody's planners and it, you know, Erin Condren went out with the rounded this for 2020 and I'm not into that. I really do like the Aura Cloud Planner that everybody's been showing, but at the same time, I'm not about to drop $100 on that. I think the starter kit was like $95. And I'm just like, mm, it's beautiful, but 15 and yeah. 15. So we just go through a normal monthly and then we have a notes page at the end of the month. And here's February divider, March divider, April. So these leave, a lot of these leave like some really creative outlets that you can get into. May. June, July, August, September, October, 
I love November. It is so cute. And then December of 2020. And then it jumps to just a note section. And let's be honest, I don't use these pages, so they'll probably come out too. Um, yeah, that's about it. So that is my most recent haul. And honestly, I really, really like this planner. And I'm really happy that I picked this planner out of all the ones that Recollections has because it just, mm, it, it speaks to me. The colorways are just beautiful. There's nothing that's, you know, really in your face. It's very muted and it stays in these purples and blues and peachy pinks. So just really, really happy. Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and seeing kind of where my planning world has been over these last little, I guess it's been almost a couple months now, which is scary. Life just keeps on moving. So if you enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up button for me. It helps me out a lot and subscribe if you're not already. I'm really going to try get back on a routine filming schedule and I will talk to you guys again very very soon. Much love to all of you and bye for now.